let's see what we know so far. Um, you all know that uh, Google went down all morning. And here's what's interesting. Google did not only go down, it all went down <laughs> from Gmail to, to YouTube. Now, ask yourself this. What kind of a problem would take all of Google down? Now, you can see lots, of, you can imagine lots of problems that would slow things down. You can imagine, I think we've all experienced Gmail being down, but it's just down by itself. Have you ever seen all of Google go down? All of it? What would cause that? Could it be a bug? Could it be a bug? Probably not. Because if you're telling me that Google is so sensitive that they would have that one bug could take it all down, I mean, what kind of bug would that be? That's some big bug. I doubt they've architected it so that one bug could take down all the unrelated systems. Maybe. I mean, I can't say that's impossible. There might be some central thing that connects them all. But somebody says a power outage. A power outage probably wouldn't take it all down because I imagine their power is backed up. It's distributed against servers around the world. What, what would it be? Now, do you think that China hacked them and took them down? I doubt it. We'd know about that, right? If it had been a China hack, that's the first thing they would have told us. YouTube, or I'm sorry, Google would have said, we have some foreign hackers, going to be down for a while. Don't think it was that. Let me tell you what it probably was. And this is just speculation, right? So there's no, there's nothing except timing. I think Google had maybe a solar wind problem. I think it's possible that Google said, uh, do we use that software that gives you God access to all your systems that China has uh, hacked? Do we have any of that? And, and I'm just, I'm just going to make a guess, pure speculation, that, that uh, YouTube realized they were massively violated across their products. And they took it all down to get rid of the same hack or the same vulnerability, because it would have been across all products. So, was this solar winds thing so bad that the entire uh, Google spectrum was infected and they had to take it all down at the same time? Or is it the biggest coincidence in the world that Google had its biggest you know, downtime that, across all products at the same time we find out that there's this nearly universal software that seems to be in lots of big companies that has God access and China uh, controls it. Which do you think is more likely? Coincidence or these two stories are connected? Because it would be a pretty big coincidence, wouldn't it? Just asking. And by the way, have you seen anybody else ask that question? Am I the first one to connect those? Um, 